You're right about that. 50 going at Diddy hard, man. But how you feel about the people that saying Jay-Z is next? Mm. Yeah, but I have been hearing that a lot. Um, I feel like your girl Jaguar Wright might have been one of the first to really put his name out there. Um, I don't know enough. You know, I, I, I will say that Jay-Z, if he was doing ill shit like that, he was more quiet about it. You know what I mean? He was more, but then if we be real with ourselves, it was kind of abnormal when he got with Beyonce. Like she was pretty young when he got with her. Um, there's rumors that he was messing with Foxy Brown when she was pretty young. Um, you know, um, so there's a lot of those rumors around. You know what I mean? I don't, you know, yeah. And and do you hear little things here and there? You know, I'm not gonna lie. When certain people get to a certain level of fame, I don't know why, but you start to hear little sh about certain people sometimes. And I don't know if, how many people are really exempt from it. Because if you really think about most of your top celebrities, black celebrities, rappers, I feel like the ones that are at the top for a long time, I feel like I've heard a rumor damn near about all of them. Not that I've seen anything, but it's always these top motherfuckers. Now, some people will say, oh, well, that's just a hating. It could be. Or it could be that motherfuckers got to join a club in order to get to a certain level. I don't know. I'm not in the club, so I wouldn't know. But it's just a little weird that every everybody that goes past a certain point, you'll hear a little. And these be, these be behind the scenes rumors too. This is not just internet shit. This be shit before the internet existed. You understand? Because it's easy for some shit to fly around now with the internet. But a lot of this shit was pre-internet. And that and, and 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 it was getting around. You see? So makes it a little different. It still could be some bullshit, but I'm just saying, some of these rumors been around about people for a long time. You've been hearing little things about them. And have I heard little shit about Jay-Z? Yup. Do I think that he's trying to um, emulate, uh, uh, emulate himself and present himself as a gay painter, like to look like Basquiat. Yep, I do. I think Fifty Cent was right about that. I think that's a code, a code to especially to white people that he's approachable, he's cultured, but Basquiat was also bisexual. So is that a code that you're trying to tell these white people too, by trying to? emulate this guy i don't know i don't know but it doesn't look good why do people have such a uh such an affinity for basquiat anyway i think it's trash let me just put it out there i don't think that basquiat's art is fucking all brilliant the way they claim it is it looks like bullshit to me it's some shit that white people would like it's not some shit that black people look at and be like oh my god that is so impressive. He ran with Andy weirdos like Andy Warhol and Keith Haring. They tried to call Keith Haring graffiti back in the days. I hated Keith Haring's art. It was crap. It was, that was not graffiti. That was a white dude from the village who was inspired by graffiti, who started doing some sh and of, because he's white, now he can go to galleries and sell this sh for fucking fifty thousand dollars and then you got real blacks and 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 yes puerto ricans you know and even some poor white people that were doing graffiti uptown on the trains and shit like that and they couldn't get no money for this shit, you know and it was way more uh technical and you know what i mean and 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 it makes you feel something and 
and really aligned itself with hip hop. Um, but all of that, sh Keith Herring, Basquiat, fucking Andy Warhol with soup cans, get the fuck out of here. That was some shit where they gamed the people into believing that some bullshit was something special. And Jay-Z was one of the first ones, I think, to really talk about Basquiat. And it's like, why? And you make a song about Tom Ford. That's, a, that's another homosexual designer. What is this all about? Like, I don't know when heterosexuals started bigging up homosexuals, starting trying to dress like them, do their hair like them, and making songs about them.